Mr. Internet. Then what's your name, little boy? I want a BB gun, and I want you to not smell like wild turkey, and not breathe on me, and not touch me. And I want a sandwich with the crust cut off, and I want... Um, when you're a kid, they, they tell you this thing about Santa Claus, and it's the coolest thing in your life. And then you grow up to learn it's a lie. And, and, uh, and you're hurt, and you never recover, and I haven't. Look, I hate to talk about Christmas now, because Christmas is over, and I know we all kind of want to put it in the rearview mirror. But seriously, shopping online for Christmas, I, I wonder. By eliminating the mall, have we, in effect, eliminated Christmas? It's weird, you know? Yeah, it's convenient. Yeah, it's easy. Yeah, you just go to Amazon.com and you avoid that trip to the mall, but I think Christmas happens at the mall. I think you're cheating yourself at Christmas by doing your shopping online. I mean, the best part of Christmas is cruising around the mall, having a candy cane, uh, sitting on Santa's lap if you're under 17, uh, maybe 11. Christmas isn't our idea of it. It's not chestnuts roasting and sleigh rides. It's going to interact with a mall Santa that smells like wild turkey. It's walking into Brookstone and buying some kind of a $37 nail file that's made out of mahogany and was designed by indigenous peoples in Papua New Guinea. Christmas is all about the mall. And if you're not there, you're missing out. That's just my opinion. You heard it here first. Stop Christmas shopping online. Get your ass down to the mall. <laughs>